Hi Taurus, thank you for being here. This is a reading for the week of October 27th through November 2nd, 2019. It's a general reading, so it won't resonate with every Taurus. But if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the excuse me to the channel. It is much appreciated. Let's get into this. So, Taurus, what's going on for this week? What's going on for Taurus this week? We have the Three of Wands and the Six of Cups. All right. So, someone you could be very far from someone. You're waiting for the opportunity to come together. Some of you are far from your children or... You're far from home. You're far from a soulmate or, or someone who you you really have a lot of love for. You're, you're away from in distance and you're thinking about a, a past situation. You may even be romanticizing it. It could be an Aquarius person with a star card here. You're wanting to heal some connection. Or you want expansion with someone who you feel like is a soulmate. Uh, who you have a soul tie with. Someone who has children. Someone who's just who you feel is really good for you. Someone who is beautiful. Someone who gets a lot of attention. Someone who uh, is, is learned. Someone who is... You want to move toward this person with Six of Swords. Wow. You want to move with this person or you want a relationship with them? You want to do something final and definite with this person. You want uh, either to give them some money, some resources. You have a lot of reservation for this person. They're, they are what you've been hoping for and wishing for. To you, they are the quintessential ideal wife. Someone could feel this way about you, Taurus, or you, they. They could be younger than you. Or you younger than them it says that some of you have some really good energy in regards to maybe a business some self-employment um, there might be some harsh judgment and or words or, or separation or, or something came to realization in regards to your family friends hanging out neighbors something came to an end or to a halt what you thought you were creating with a particular person and that some of you it could be divorce it could be separation some of you are learning some learning some things about maybe um, like how you were brought up early childhood stuff and you're coming to some realization that you need to fix something about you uh, six of Wands, something about you. you you're shining a spotlight on you and tearing down old regimes old dynamics that you either held for yourself um, the old way of thinking the old way of doing so you're weighing up some decision taking some time to think about it here but you're of two minds about it. It says, in order to gain clarity here, get under some spiritual practice, meditation, some mentorship, where they can help you weed through so you can make the right choice. You can make a beneficial change. Something about a move here. Uh, something about you wanting to move. Some of you are waiting for paperwork, waiting for the answer, waiting for um, someone to dictate how you can move or how you can do something. Once again, it's been a struggle. It's been an uphill battle. What is the advice for Taurus here in regards to some of you waiting for waiting to move, waiting to have something, some paperwork come to completion and you get a resolution, an answer. Some of you are wanting to be with someone maybe that you are reconnecting with or you have reconnected with. Uh, this may be a second go around in regards to love and romance. The tower here. Some of you could be dealing with a Scorpio. It says the advice here is to allow, to allow the 
challenge in a particular project to happen because something was built on faulty ground either this is a relationship or this is a project the star again allow the the feelings that you're having the reservations you're having to manifest because then you can go into these are these are cards that are in order uh, in sequence um so you have the tower a br complete breakdown a shift of energy and then the healing process starts with the star some of you have to accept something accept accept how you feel accept who you are accept how you look nine of pentacles accept the fact that maybe someone is for you or that this business is for you that you can be successful and fruitful here some of you need to accept the fact that you are at a place in your life where you need to make start making solid decisions in regards to moving forward um two of pentacles again so you're getting some of the repeating the same cards the advice here is for you to make a decision you're gonna have to take action on something it's like a choice of where to establish or who to establish life with someone is far you don't know if you should go back and apologize and then have the reestablishment of the relationship some of you are longing to do that let's see what the advice the advice of the uh, angel answers cards are right, the advice here is to to apologize to you know put heart and hand and say what it is you need to say um, some of you have never really let go of a particular person place or thing a home some of you are waiting for the opportunity to move recovery yeah whatever that was lost here with maybe with a particular person not the right time not the right time to maybe to move towards or to make the grand gesture you need to figure out some things for yourself if you believe you can heal you can move out of that unknown that immature space there will be the opportunity for you to move forward let's see what the shells say here uh what does the shell say for Taurus this week, October 27th through the November 2nd? Marriage, job, and thoughts. It's like you have the thoughts of marrying someone. You feel like you found the ideal person. But you feel like you need another job or, the, or they don't have a job. Or you feel like you're not up for taking on the job. Your thoughts are, are all over the place. It says sit with yourself. Financial abundance and blessings here also. Um, he who finds a wife finds a good thing. And you can talk to some other married people who are successfully married. Whatever that may be for you. Um, it help ease your mind in, reg in that regard. A lot of blessings. Blessings. And financial abundance come to those who actually come together um, spirit ancestors angels whomever or whatever you believe in they love mo no more than to bless a union it seems like you found that with someone but you're also scared of taking on the responsibility of that okay Taurus and this could be how someone feels about you also all right, um, go over to the website, book a reading there. Um, take advantage of all the readings that are on sale, the 72-hour energy reading, the two-question uh, email reading that comes to you via email, um, the 20-minute phone reading where you can ask as many questions as you would like. All right, so Joyce, thank you. Take care, guys. All links are below.